Yes, sir. Each and every game, I try to uh, bring that energy. That's my job, so I try to do my job as well as possible. Trendon, did this... Um... Go ahead. Go ahead, Mike. Ah. Did this mean a little bit more to you? Oh, yeah, definitely it did. But, um, you know, before the game, Coach Wade just came up to me and just told me to let the game come to me. And, um, you know, that's what I did. I didn't try to press anything. So, um, but, yeah, definitely, you know, this was the way it definitely meant a lot. Uh, Skyler, um, Coach uh, told us there would be a lot of intensity at practice when we spoke to him the other day. Was there, and did it change anything for you, you guys the way you played? Yeah, that's just kind of how it is. Uh, and uh, we embrace it, and uh, it just makes us play harder. And uh, I think we definitely took some steps today as far as uh, what everyone's kind of been worried about with us closing games. I think we did a good job of that today. At halftime, what was, uh, I guess, uh, for any of y'all, that the mood like as far as it was like, uh, we've played a great half, now let's go finish the job? Yeah, I think we uh, we showed growth today. Um, uh, you know, we, we still didn't play our best half, and uh, I think they might have won the second half, but uh, it's definitely different from what it's been in the past. So uh, we took steps forward, and uh, that's something to be proud of. Yeah, it, you know, this, I think, this could be for any one of you guys, but they cut the lead to nine a couple times in that second half. You guys were able to you know, bounce back and get it back up to double digits. I mean, just kind of what was the message in that second half as they kind of cut it down a little bit on you guys? Sticking to the game plan. Uh, um, and, uh, you know, especially these two guys doing a great job on the offensive glass, getting us extra p possessions and taking time off the clock and getting more shots. So, um, you know, I think we did a great job. Uh, and uh, not letting the, the scoreboard dictate how hard we competed. Scott, the coach said uh, Monday's practice was pretty spirited. How, how about yesterday? Did y'all have really good practices uh, according to what he told us the other day? Yeah, usually when we play this way, it's because we had great practices and we have momentum going into the, you know, outside of uh, the streak that we got going, we've got great practices. Uh, giving us momentum to come into these games and, and play hard and, and make the plays that we do. Uh, we had a lot of extra effort plays, uh, starting with these two guys. Um, but, uh, you know, we understand the importance of practice and how that helps us play uh, a lot better. This is for uh, Trendon and Emmett. When you guys are getting loose and crashing the glass like you were doing and, you know, getting a lot of crowd-inspiring, you know, finishes at the rim, does it – feed off each other. Could you kind of give me your mindsets when, when all that starts happening and how it kind of loosens everything up for everybody? Uh, yeah, but I would say, you know, it definitely loosens it up for all of us. And, um, you know, that's why we have the big lineup that we have, you know, me at the three, days at the four, and Emmett at the five. So, you know, we use that to our advantage and, um, you know, we just crash the, crash the offensive glass and, uh, you know, just try to box out on the defensive end and, um, you know, as best as we can. And, you know, I think that's definitely an advantage for us. I just tell him to shoot the ball and I'll try to get it off the glass. But I mean, that plays into your game and your kind of energy. I love it. So I just tell him to shoot it, I'll get the rebound. Yeah, Skylar, you've seen Emmett have some games where he brings energy, but tonight, were you at times where you think, like, he's, he's just knocking people over and, and dunking him every time he gets the ball? Were you just like, at times, like, wow, he's, he's really just got it going? Well, Emmett brings the energy every game. It's not just some games. Uh, you know, he's our enforcer. He's our anchor on defense. Uh, he's the most vocal guy. He's the one. He's the back line. And, uh, you know, he's been doing a great job for us all year. And he's an integral part of the, you know, the reason that we're on a nine-game winning streak. And, you know, that's something that he's going to be consistent with. And that's something we can bank on every game. Just for be for any of y'all, uh, they were 10 of 38 tonight from the three-point line. We knew how much they were shooting. They like to shoot the three ball. They got a lot of attempts, but only 26%. What was so key in your perimeter defense, maybe to throwing them off a little bit? Uh, leading up to one shot so we can get the re rebound. And, um, you know, I would say just coming into the game, we knew the scout. And uh, we knew Shackleford, Petty, you know, Kyle, we knew they like to take, you know, take a lot of threes. And uh, we, knew we, we knew they like to take a lot of off, you know, off the bounce threes. And that's what we wanted them to do. You know, just make it hard for them. You know, they are good shooters, so you know it's definitely gonna be hard to stop them from making all of them. But um, you know, we just wanted to make wanted to make tough ones, and um, you know that's what we, that's what we did. Trending and Emmett, if you want to answer this, but Skyler, I kind of talked to it about um, following the scout. 
and, and making strides mm -hmm. in the practices and paying off in games. You know, as this happens, do you see this and kind of like, oh, coach is right, you know, maybe we do need to do this? Oh, yeah, definitely. Um, you know, we knew what we had to work on a few days ago. You know, we knew we don't like closing games like we don't like closing games out like that, just like y'all don't like it. But um, <laughs> so, you know, we're definitely trying to get better at that. And, um, you know, I feel like today, you know, today was definitely a step, you know, a step forward. In the back here, yeah. Could, could one of you comment on limiting Petty to one of seven shooting and four points? What went into that? I can hear you. Uh, Petty? You heard well, Petty. Well, uh, Petty ain't going to have many games like that the rest of the year. He's a really good player. But, uh, you know, we just tried to make it tough for him. And shots weren't falling for him tonight. Uh, and that was a good thing for us. Thank you.